Hello and welcome to Torbay. Seaside special and tonight's special guests are Penny Whistleman Des Lane, comedian Janet Brown, Mike Bat, from Sweden Abba, Compares Daly and Wayne, Kenneth Magella, and guest star Lulu. right there. Uh, no one told me it was a flag day. Anyhow, I was walking along the seafront today and I came across a very, very strange man who I think is probably on my left right now. He was selling tea bags with little perforations in them. And I looked very closely and what do you know? It's Roy Hart. Roy. <laughs> Tell me, Roy, what are, you... <laughs> what are you doing down here? Well, you know, Tony, 
Uh, actually, I'm only just down here on holiday, so I'm not going to do much in it. But I'll tell you what I am going to do. I love do. the hat. You like it? Yeah. It doesn't make me look too Jewish, does no. it? No. Oh. No, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what I'm going to introduce. I'm going to introduce yeah. one of my favourite daredevils. Mm. Devil's one of the greatest daredevils in the world, actually. Who's that? He's a friend. He's sitting right here on my left here. Yeah. Here he is. Look at that. No, it's not Rolf Harris's dad. You're wrong. <laughs> or Archbishop Macarius. This is a pal of mine all the way from Persia, Khalil Ogab, and he is the strongest, one of the strongest men in Persia. Do you know that? Fantastic. Look at that. Yeah. You fancy that, look? Stand up and have a feel. Have a feel of Khalil. Come on. Give him a feel. There we are. Oh, by golly, she likes it. Oh, she's gone all fat. <laughs> Sit down again. Boy. She's gone right off the old man. There we are. <laughs> Right, I think we'd better come back to you a I little bit later on, I think we better sit because she's getting a bit overexcited. <laughs> sit down, Galil, you'll be all right. Ladies and gentlemen, will you please welcome our uh, confairs for this evening, Daly and Wayne. <laughs> Home is where I want to be Been on the road so long, my friend and if you came along, I know you wouldn't disagree It's the same old story, yeah Everywhere I go, I get stranded Libel, I hear words I never heard in the Bible And I'm just one step from the shoe shine Just two steps from the county line Just trying to keep my customers satisfied, satisfied It's the same old story yeah. Everywhere I go, I get slandered Life don't bear words I've ever heard in the Bible And I'm just one step on the sea shine Just two steps from the county line Just trying to keep my customers satisfied, satisfied Thank you. Tell me, what do you do for a living? What do I do? Yeah. Oh, you're a milkman. <laughs> I dance. What do you do? I'm a singer. <laughs> Do you mind if I sing? No, go ahead. Granada, tierra soñada por mí. Mi cantar es el vuelvo y dan a cuanto es para ti. I'm going out for some fish and chips. Would you like any? <laughs> Anybody else like any? Yeah. Well, go get your bloody own. <laughs> Before, hey, I must tell you something. I'm getting engaged next week. Getting engaged? Yes. Who to? To a circus performer. Really? Yeah. Which one? One of the elephants. <laughs> one of the what? One of the elephants. <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this, but uh, you can't get engaged to an elephant. Are you sure? Can you get engaged to an elephant? No. Does anybody want to buy an engagement ring? Me <laughs> <laughs> It's your fantasia. Mi cantor, Lord of Melancholia. Pero de vengo a to. Mi coriato se non è a to no. Sing. No, no, I'd like to do a, a joke, actually. You'd like to do a joke? Yeah. On your own? On my own. 
Well, let's hear it. All right. It was these two Irish fellas. Oh, wait a minute, Bill. No Irish jokes. No. Everybody does Irish jokes. All right. It was this rabbi. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, no religious jokes. Somebody will get offended. Well, there was this penny whistle man. <laughs> he knows he's working well tonight. <laughs> oh, who are you? <laughs> he says he's the happy whistler. kidding you, Des. Can yeah. we help you in any way? Well, I hope so. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to play on a military opus for Penny Whistle. That's you. Drums. That's, that's Kevin. Kevin. And we hope later on yourselves and the audience. That's, that's great. great. Right. So you wet your whistles, and I'll tell you when. Ladies and gentlemen, Des Lane. comes your turn. Have you wet your whistles? We'll see. Oh, now come on, you can whistle better than that. I tell you what, especially for the ladies, if you can't whistle, you can la la la, but this time let's really raise the roof. about that Des Lane? He's a tremendous whistler, oh, eh? he's wonderful. Fantastic. I bet you can't whistle like that. How much do you bet? I bet you a thousand pounds. I can't whistle? Yeah. It's a thousand pounds. Go and whistle for it. <laughs> I won't whistle for that, but I'll tell you who I whistle, will whistle for. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'll whistle for our next, next artist. Yeah. She's fantastic. Yeah. Your favourite singer? My favourite singer, uh -huh. I know. Oh, I know. And somebody I'm sure you're all waiting to see and meet. So let's hear it for Lulu! So 
some call it folk, some call it soul, but people let me tell you it was rock and roll. I was raised on rock, got that rhythm in my soul. That the DJs played From Honky Tonk to Hound Dog And Johnny the Good Chain Gang and Love is Strange And I found one day I was real on rock Got that rhythm in my soul Down the classical list My papa loved to listen to those old country songs While I was in the back room Digging the stones I was raised on rock Got that rhythm in the soul We'll see Lulu just a little bit later on. Roy, what are we going to do now? Well, gonna... I tell you, Tony, uh, now's yeah. the time when I'm going to introduce a strongman to you. Well, I hope you don't mind, but I'm not at all impressed by that. You're not impressed? No. no. <laughs> Why? I, I am very strong myself. <laughs> I'm so strong that I can actually spit money. You can spit money? Really? I'd like to see that. All right, then, you will. <laughs> 10p. <laughs> There's your change. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Everyone is in. Everyone a winner. <laughs> We better stop now before we do the whole of Mike and Bernie's act. And now, <laughs> and now, folks, mums and dads, boys and girls, it's my pleasure to introduce to you from Persia, Mr. Khalil Ogarb. <laughs> There he is, my boy. Now, Khalil, come over here. All right, now, Lil. Well, I tell you what, Lil's going to do first. <laughs> He's going to attempt to lift this 75-pound weight in his choppers. So you're going to have a go at that, Khalil? <laughs> Off you go, lad. By golly. Look at that. Ooh, shut up, shut up. <laughs> OK, here we go. Marvellous stuff. This... <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, yeah. And now, folks, I'm going to ask my assistant Kelly to thump Carl Lille in the bread basket with a 14-pound sledgehammer. But before you do, mate, don't forget, be careful how you swing it, or the air will soon turn blue. <laughs> well, a slip of your grip and wallop, he'll be known as Danny LaRue. Off you go. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, he loves it, look. Ooh. 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 Ooh, blimey, how about that? And now, folks, Carlyle is going to attempt to lift the combined weights of us all. That's uh, nearly 100 stone. And he's going to attempt to lift it with his feet, and he should do very well because he takes the same size shoes as Lady Antonia Fraser. Right. <laughs> Off you go, Carlyle. Let's have it.
We're in Tilve at this very moment. There are literally thousands of uh, Swedish students all here to learn English. Actually, that's what I came here for as well. But uh, they will particularly like our next group because they won the Eurovision Song Contest a couple of years ago. And when I say to you, Waterloo, immediately, you will welcome, please, ABBA! <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like, like to introduce a very charming lady, one of the nicest people in show business. Sit back and enjoy Miss Janet Brown. May I have the pleasure of your company? For I'd like to spend these moments here with you. If I could have the pleasure of your company Chatting in a friendly interview Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. That's just what I'm going to do. I'm going to interview with some of the interesting people who are in Torquay tonight. So, Dora Bryan, may I have the pleasure of your company? Oh. Oh, isn't that what Wedgwood Ben said to the chairman of Leyland Motors? But you know, I'm having a lovely holiday here. Oh, I am. Though it's funny, isn't it? We save up all the year for two weeks on the sands and then spend the next 50 weeks on the rocks. <laughs> bye bye for now. Bye. Hello, it's Fanny Craddock here. <laughs> and I'm sampling one of the most auspicious, nutritious, and delicious dishes to be found in this part of the world. It's pasty beans and chips. <laughs> Do have a chip, Janet. It's perfectly all right. I have washed my hands. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry if Johnny doesn't seem too bright, but I think he's had his chips. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Good eating and good night. And here, to tell us how she likes our brass band music, is that very famous Greek singer, Miss Nana Muscori. I think <laughs> your brass bands are very beautiful because I do like to stroll along the prom, prom, prom. <laughs> Where your brass bands play tiddly um bum bum. <laughs> the words, the words have such meaning and beauty. Like the words of this little Greek song. Where the little Greek girl turns to the little Greek boy and with love in her eyes and in her heart, she sings Me Katurito Maroto, which means I've got a lovely bunch of cookies. 